Hi, I'm Linda Scott and this is Monk. Monk is a seven-year-old Cooper's Hawk that came to Liberty Wildlife in 2012. He was found on the ground as a very young bird by a very well-meaning person who wanted to help him. Um, and that person kept him at home and fed him and then tried to release him and saw that he really couldn't fly well. And that's when he was brought to Liberty Wildlife. He had a left wing injury, it was an old fracture that had calcified and, and uh, tried to heal itself so the, so the break wasn't particularly repairable. So he's partially flighted, but not well enough to fly and hunt. Um, so he's been with us since then. Um, I've been here since before Monk came to Liberty Wildlife. I've been here either 22 or 23 years. I can't remember exactly <laughs> what year it is that I, that I came to Liberty. Monk is standing on his breakfast, which is quail, and that's typical of what he would be eating in the wild. Um, Cooper's hawks, <laughs> he's squeezing that food, uh, pretending that he's killing it, or feeling like he's killing it. And that is, that's how uh, these hawks kill their food, is with those feet. They have tremendous strength for such a uh, skinny little leg in those talons. And they are primarily hunting other birds, so they have short wings for their body size and a very long tail that acts as a rudder so they can quickly maneuver between branches and twigs and thick brush in pursuit of mostly other birds. So quail is a typical thing to, for him to eat um, here. Uh, Monk is an education bird because he's not releasable to the wild and because he kind of agreed to do this job. As you can see, he'll stand on the glove and um, and be happy to have people come up and look at him and learn about him. You can see he has beautiful eyes. They are bright, bright yellow orange. Uh, eventually they're gonna get more towards red, like red orange. And that is a sign of a fully uh, mature and reproductively ready Cooper's Hawk when those eyes are totally red. They change over time, as does the plumage. He has his full grown up feathers on. As juveniles, they're white down the front with, with vertical streaks instead of this beautiful rust with the horizontal white barring. So, Monk here does a great job as an education ambassador, um, teaching people about the birds around them. You can see these birds right here in the city, especially in the winter time when we have migrants from out of state. You can hear them talking right then. That uh, little sound he made is typical of a bird that was in uh, human care as a baby. He's sort of talking to me, which would be really unusual for a wild bird to do. Um, but since he was in human care since he was a baby, he, he never really lost his talk to who's feeding him kind of behavior.